The Three Doof Doofs by Claudie Potter, Stephen Wallace, and Wynand Botha. What is that? What is that doof 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 noise? A cat? A mouse? A visitor in the house? No, it's something even furrier than a cat, even cuter than a mouse, and much tinier than you and me. It's the three doof doofs. These sweet creatures have only one foot each to hop on, and each hop makes a thumping doof doof on the floor. Ah, oh. Here's Solly Doof, the smart one, who's always thinking long and loud. He uhs and ahs and doof doofs all night long. He reads daytime stories to the other doof doofs because, unlike you and me, that's when they sleep. Thinky, stinky, Solly Doof prefers reading over bathing any time. And here is Sally Doof, the smallest and sweetest Doof Doof of all three. In a little quiet voice, she sings Dooby Dooby Doof Doof songs when it gets a bit too quiet in the night. She likes finding shiny things and cuddles. Snuggly, huggly, Sally Doof, who loves to sing. Clink, clink, clunk. Don't forget Silly Doof, the funniest Doof Doof in the house. He's always joking. <laughs> Wiggly, giggly, Silly Doof will make you laugh until your tummy hurts. He cheers up the other doof doofs whenever they feel sad. He loves to dance on his big silly foot to the songs that Sally Doof sings. So, if at night you hear a strange doof doof noise again, remember it's just the three doof doofs reading, singing, and dancing on their one doof doof foot. So sleep well, little one, or keep one eye open, because maybe, just maybe, you'll see three cute little creatures hopping past on one foot going doof, doof, Doof.